Hello everyone, welcome back to the Casualty Hardcore Gaming Channel yet again. This is your host Nick bringing you yet another video. Let's dive into today's topic. So there is a lot happening right now in Gears of War 4. A lot of content is on the horizon and that's what this video is here to bring to you is the information on what's going down throughout the next couple of months within Gears. Starting off on the week of February 12th, which is this week, and also happy Valentine's Day to those watching this video. Keep its Torque Bow tag is live and well. Do a couple challenges and you'll get Fleming Weapon Skins, which I'll talk about here later. Year of the Dog Horde event happens later this month, February 16th to March 2nd. And then in early March, new achievements will be dropping alongside a St. Patrick's Versus event, which will be the first St. Patrick's event ever to happen in Gears of War. Later also in March, a Horde event will have more epic Crimson Omen weapon skins. I will be showing off some of that eventually gameplay wise. Those skins are amazing. And then towards the end of March, early April will be the Bunny Hunt event from last year making a return. And then Juvie Madness also returns early April. And also more information is to be announced, but those are the core events happening soon. So let's dive into a little bit more specific detail about Cupid's Torque Bow tag so far happening this week. So, like stated earlier, Cupid's Torque Bow Tag returns yet again for another debut event here in Gears of War 4. And the two weapons that are available this time around are the Flaming Enforcer and the Flaming Torque Bow. The Flaming Enforcer's unlock requirements are get 100 kills within the playlist you have until February 19th at 10 a.m. Pacific to get it. And then alongside the Torque Bow, the challenges is only win five matches. These are very easy to do. You have a lot of time to do it. All you gotta do is log on to the website, which I'll have the link in the description below sign in register your gamer tag and all rewards will be granted to players by mid-march so another crazy thing that dropped this week is mardi gras weapon skins the glitz flashy and ornate are only available this week this entire sets are 400 credits per box dropping three different weapons with the different skins they look pretty fantastic again if you want to check out what they look like go to the wink below the link not the wink and go check it out for yourself they look really cool and it's another 400 credit box which means these are very easily easily able to grind and not to pay any money for so taking a little pause here, man, this has been a lot of content coming in February. It's it's a lot of awesome things coming to Gears of War 4, especially after the season pass cycle has ended. So it really truly shows how much Black Tusk Studios, or now the Coalition, is really dedicating their resources to Gears. But more information dropping your way. Series 3 is finally dropped, and in celebration of the Winter Olympics, the really cool Oscar skins are now available. The Luchador Oscar Collection and the Wrestler Oscar Collection, except for emblems, will become craftable in Gears of War 4 alongside all the skins on well, the weapons that are also dropped alongside those character skins. And the final piece of information is the coolest thing of all. So, the coolest bit of information today is the fact that the Phantom Weapon Skin sets are returning yet again, but in a different form, this form being the Pink Weapon Phantom Skin set that is available now by doing a certain set of challenges centered around Gears of War Pro Circuit play. You can either do some of the ranked escalation matches, or you can watch some online stuff. Right now, the event is taking place. I do know that two of the skins have already passed, so if you haven't gotten a chance to go check out what you need to do to unlock those skins, I really urge you to click on the link below. There's a full description on on their web page showing you what exactly challenges wise you need to do to get this awesome weapon skin set and i mean it's valentine's day today why not have an awesome pink weapon skin set to go along with your gears of war character i know i'll be rocking this as soon as i pick up some of those skins so once again i want to thank you so much for watching another one of our videos i know our gears of war fan base here is quite strong and we really appreciate the following you have with our gears of war i personally love the game the most and i love to cover it and share more and more information this game comes along with i know with gears of war 5 on the horizon which was mentioned briefly by microsoft during the game pass announcement that more content for gears of war 4 will continue to come down the pipeline until gears of war 5 eventually launches but on that final note I am Nick. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. And if you liked this video, leave a thumbs up, maybe subscribe. And I can't wait to see you again. Keep on fragging trucks.